You get the facts at John Henry Drums. White people, even though most white people are not consciously understanding their problem in genetics, they are certainly aware that they are genetically dominated by people of color. That's why it was a statement, one, block, one drop of black blood makes you black, because people of color have the genetic capacity to annihilate white people. And so unless white people control the reproductivity of people of color, then we have, we can postulate that perhaps one day there won't be any white people. And I think that the very survival of white people necessitates that they project genetic inferiority on people of color because it is they who really are aware that they are genetic recessive and perhaps genetically inferior to people of color. And I am not saying this to to call uh, the condition of skin whiteness to say, well, no, white people are inferior. I'm not saying it for that purpose, but I think that it is of prime importance for the majority of people.